Hi everyone, this is Rob from Cruise Seekers and I'm just here to talk a little bit about the Royal Caribbean Unlimited Dining Package. This is a real great way to add some extra value to your cruise that can get you some really nice specialty dining at a really, really good price. Come with me and let me kind of explain what we can do here and how much value we can add to your cruise. So the unlimited dining package becomes available to you once you book your cruise. You would log into the Royal Caribbean site and gain access to your cruise planner for your cruise that you just booked. When you're there, choose the dining option. The dining option will give you a bunch of different options there. You can do a chops plus one. You can book individual restaurants if you wish. You can buy a three night package. But if you, the unlimited dining package is something that you want, you're going to have to book it soon because this is in limited quantities. If they sell out, you can't book it anymore. So if you're happy with the price that they're showing on the cruise planner, book it. If the price goes down when another sale comes around, don't worry. You can always cancel your unlimited dining package, get your money back, and rebook it. There is some time for the money to come back to you at Royal Caribbean. So that's one little thing you have to worry about. But at least you know you're getting the better price and you just have to wait for your money. But that's the way it works. So if you want the unlimited dining package and you see something for it and it's a good price, book it, be happy with it. If it goes down, you can always cancel and rebook it. So just make sure you get it if you want it. So now you're probably wondering, what are the ins and outs of the unlimited dining package? Well, you do have access to your specialty dining for your evening meals whenever you want. You can go at any time, you can go um, twice if you even want to, as long as your reservations don't overlap, but you know, you'll be in a restaurant for four hours and you're on a cruise ship. So who really wants to be eaten for four hours? I know there's so much to do on a cruise ship, you don't want to be stuck in a restaurant. Don't worry, you can always visit this restaurant a second time. There's no fear of missing out here. There's plenty of options with the unlimited dining package. Go to your nice meal, enjoy your ship, because you also have access to sea day lunches and also a lunch on embarkation day. So again, more options for specialty dining. Really, really, really cool. Another little perk about the unlimited dining package is if you're a wine drinker, you can get 40% off a bottle of wine that's under $100. That's a great option, especially if you're not a person that wants the, you know, the unlimited beverage package. Um, I think they call it the deluxe beverage package on Royal Caribbean. And, you know, if you're not a big drinker and you just want a couple of glasses of wine with your meal at the evening, then this is a great option. It gives you a good alternative to get your alcohol at a lower price with your evening meals. So it's great. That even will cork your bottle and have it ready for you for another meal in another restaurant at any time on the ship. They'll just take your name, they'll cork it, you'll just tell them where you're gonna be next night and they'll make sure it's there for you the following night. So it's another good option too. You can get a really good value out of this ultimate dining package because believe it or not, there's more. You can get access to the a la carte restaurants too. Every restaurant has a certain amount of money you can use at an a la carte restaurant on a sitting and you can just go at any time you want. These a la carte restaurants a lot of times are open up the whole time while the ship is active. So say you want to have like a, some wings in between lunch and dinner and you want to head over to Playmakers for that. It's included. Or if you're having a nice kind of evening and you want to go to have a campfire cookie at the end of the day at Playmakers, you can do that too. You can also do sushi snacks at Izumi. Great option. So you will get your value out of this. You don't have to kind of say, I got to go to two meals, you know, at a night. No, you don't have to. There's going to be plenty of options for you throughout your cruise to use this in such a way that you're going to get tremendous value for your money. And that's about it with the unlimited dining package. I hope you can see the value that you can get out of it. We're really excited about using it on our Lord of the Seas cruise that we have coming up on February 27th. We'll let you know exactly how much value we did get out of it with the follow-up video. So look for that in the future. Until then, have a great day. And remember, always seek the seas, seek life, and seek your friends and family. Take care now. Bye-bye.